join me on one of the hottest weekends yet in the van as we go to Valley Springs, California and see some of the cutest animals. It was 115 degrees when I got in this van. Not outside, but the van was registering at 115. I'm trying to put you near the air conditioning. My, my camera has already turned off because of the temperature in like two minutes because it's like 100 degrees. So this may not have been the best idea to get out in this weather. But yeah, I picked a late campground because I was planning on jumping in. And then after I booked the campground the next day, I read the reviews and oh my, I do not think I'm getting in that lake. Ooh. Oh, there's some cows taking a little dip on the side of the road. They're cooling off. It's hot. Uh, but anyway, I probably have about an hour to go, but I wanted to check in before I got there. See you in a minute. I just pulled in. <laughs> I thought I saw everything when I pulled in. And then I pull in, pull in, and can you see them? Where are they? There is another mama and baby, completely different. There's a little family. So I'm gonna get out. Cause they're on the next campsite over. So the stuff that makes the money is never recorded. Okay, I just totally fell. <laughs> I don't know what, but this little stool did not work. <laughs> and those poor little deer don't know what to do. They're like, is she okay? So I totally damaged. <laughs> I cannot use this anymore. And then, yeah, kind of hurt myself. Dress. Oh well, the deer's still here. <sighs> okay, I'm going to walk and check things out. Then I'm going to wash my hands off. Ugh. The babies are still down there though. But yeah, it's kind of gross. Especially from what I've read. I'm pretty much in the shade and have a nice little view. Okay, I'm gonna go clean myself up, maybe put a band-aid on, and I guess get the van organized. Freshly seasoned from the market.
I'm gonna have a bruise. Yeah. Look at my view. Dang. It is actually very cool out here right now. It's, I think, 7.30. So the sun's down. I think I'm going to get some pretty colors out. It looks kind of cotton candy. And I have the water. It's just very peaceful out here. And then there's the boats. With the country music. Well, I should probably clip that out. <laughs> That's loud, I think. It sucks fixing the fan testing the fan spending a whole day in over 100 degrees temperatures sweating <laughs> profusely changing out a motherboard adding on a voltage protector and check this out well it's not doing it now <laughs> it started the green beeping again So now I may end up leaving because I don't know that I can survive the night. There it is. A minute. It lasted a minute and there's a mosquito. Great. I think I need to sage this fan. Because I think I'm going to have problems the whole time if I don't. Hot. big splash over there I don't know it sounded like it was bigger than a fish and then when I looked out it was like out in here so maybe it was a big fish you see that there's probably fish out there
So I've been sitting out here for about 90 minutes, two hours or so, maybe. This has been so peaceful. The most peaceful part, I mean, I love the nature part, the animals, that was adorable, but the water. It's very calming, just sitting and watching it flow with the wind. So yeah, lakes, rivers, oceans. That's what I crave. <laughs> Okay, so it is 11 o'clock or just after and checkout is at 2. So I am going to uh, cut it here. I am going to hang out for the next three hours until 2 o'clock and I'm going to have lunch. But I'm going to enjoy the water. So I'm going to put the camera away. Who else enjoys the water and find it calming and actually crave it? Because I sure do. So next week I will be headed north. I'll be visiting a friend along my way. So check back for that adventure and I'll see you next time. Thanks for watching.